everybody. Hope everyone's doing good. So this is going to be my review of the Diva Curl product line. I have been using the product line for about, I'm going to say three and a half weeks, so I feel pretty confident about what I'm about to share. But first I just want to give you a little hair update. If you saw my last video, you know that my hair looked pretty rooty. So I was finally able to get in with my hairstylist, um, Donnie, and she was able to touch me up. Um, we actually went slightly lighter on top here, um, and then she took me back down to my natural hair color, which is dark brown, down below here, because we're actually going to work on growing out my hair. Like many of you, I would like really long luscious curly hair so we're gonna work on that together I'm kind of excited so I'll keep you guys updated with my length checks and just to see how the health of my hair is going because we all know health is the main thing that we're going for so alright so on to my review oh forgot to mention I also got my hair trimmed and she shaped me up I noticed that a few of my curls are kind of going every which way and anytime that's happening I know that it is time for a trim. So there's just a, uh, a hint or a clue for you. If your hair is starting to act crazy, you're getting angel knots and things like that, it's probably time for a trim. So just bite the bullet and go do it. Your hair is going to love you because even like the shape and the definition for me is better. So there you go. Okay, so on to the review. Diva Curl. I decided to try out this product because um, I saw Shy Email, I think his name is, on Instagram. And I'll put his information down below in the comment box. And um, he's called the Curl Doctor just because he's able to really just go, ahead, go in and revitalize curly hair. Whether or not you just have fuzzy hair, you don't know how to take care of your hair, you got a bad haircut, heat damage, whatever it is, he brings curls back to life. And he recommended this product because it is um, sulfate free, paraben free, and silicone free. I have been wanting to try out a more natural product with um, chemicals that aren't as harsh, so I thought, hey, he, the Curl Doctor is recommending this line, I'm going to give it a try. So. At first I picked up the travel size, <laughs> I know everyone's laughing probably too, I picked up the travel size kit just to try it out and big curly hair, we use a lot of product, it didn't last long. Um, but one thing I discovered is they had a light gel and I know some of you guys are thinking, gel, no, I'm not a gel, friend. Um, I'm not a gel fan either, um, just because you, you probably saw my wash and go, I I'm in love with mixed chicks, but um, since it was a part of the line, I wanted to try it. And they had this light angel, it's called. It's a light um, gel, and it did not work very well for my hair. I was a little discouraged, but the curl, the curl doctor said if you are switching from parabens and sulfates, it's going to take about five washes so for your hair to kind of get used to the product. So you'll need five washes for your hair to adjust to the product and for you to see healthier hair. And it was true for me because especially that first wash, my hair felt dry and it wasn't defined. And I was like, what have I gotten myself into? You know, I felt like I was transitioning again. Like you don't know if your hair is going to turn out and I'm not used to that, you know? So I hung in there and I'm happy I did. So right now I'm just going to show you a little clip of how I applied the product just so you can see how I did it. Then we will come back and I will wrap this review up.
all in all, I would give this product a B. I say B just because um, the gel for me doesn't hold as well as the Mixed Chicks product line, their leave-in conditioner. For me, the hold is not there. But there, I'm told there actually is another gel called Archangel that has more hold than the Ultra Defining Gel, and I'm going to give that a try, so I will report back. Um, oh, overall, like I said, I give the product line a B. Each and every one of these products that are in the line smell amazing. They're fabulous. It's kind of like, kind of like a citrusy smell. It's fabulous. The one condition, and um, it says it's ultra creamy daily conditioner. So the first thing that I did, I put it in. First of all, it has fabulous slip. Um, I was actually able to detangle in the shower, and I can never normally detangle in the shower, just because I don't trust it. I've actually taken. Like I was, you know, detangling in the shower with my wide tooth comb and I've actually taken out a chunk of, in my hair uh, several years back just because I couldn't feel um, that the conditioner didn't have slip and it was just pulling on my hair and I didn't know it. So my stylist is like, yeah, you're not detangling in the shower anymore. You're going to do it outside. But with this, it had so much slip, I was confident enough to detangle in the shower. So that was great. My hair just loved this conditioner. It just soaked it up. So for the first wash, I actually washed it out. But after that, I just, the washes that I've done after that, I've just kept it in, so. And it's nice, it's light, it's light enough to use as a leave-in conditioner, so. There you go. I'm feeling like the natural product lines are the way to go. So, um, like if you are looking for something that is sulfate free, paraben free, silicone free, this is a line I think for you. It is a little pricey. Um, these bottles are about you know forty dollars <laughs> so it's up there. I picked up this product line from Sephora um, but yeah I would I would definitely recommend you give it a go. I'll kind of turn for you so you can see. And there you have it. That's my review for the Diva Curl line. If you have any questions, please place those in the comment box below. As always, please like, subscribe, and share. And um, you guys have a blessed day. Thank you. Bye.